YouTube, what's the deal? It's your man, Everything King. Got some Detroit Lions talk for y'all today. Woke up this morning, got some uh, got some news from the Detroit Lions, so I figured I'd go ahead on and come on here and talk to my fellas, man. You know, I haven't did no videos, of course, on the preseason games because I know better than that. Um, and that's pretty much what I'm going to talk about today. First of all, news. They cut Ridley. They cut the running back Ridley this morning. The five-year veteran. They signed him to a one-year deal, but they released him this morning. And a lot of that probably got to do with, you know, Amir Abdullah coming back. Them having Theo Reddick. And the showing that Washington has showed. So, um, unless they're getting ready to set up something else where they're getting ready to sign somebody else. So you never know what's in the mix, man. Uh, they gonna continue making moves until you know the season actually probably end the season as well due to injury. So you know it is what it is. But they released Ridley. I feel like Washington had a better performance preseason, but it's the preseason. So you know neither one of them is gonna start. Neither one of them is the backup running back. So to me, it is what it is. Um, but back to the main topic, the reason why your mans don't do preseason. Let me let y'all understand something, first and foremost. I am straight up flabbergasted, and that's right, I'm going to use Bill, that, that's a, a surgeon, I'm going to use his type of terms. I am flabbergasted. <laughs> And what some of these cats are saying and how they're judging the preseason. We should know this already, man. The Detroit Lions have been preseason champions for how long? And then go in the season and then what happened? Get their ass kicked. Started out, what shit, one and five after we after we did good in the preseason? It's the preseason. Teams do not use their pro sets in the preseason. They want to see what people have to offer. You're not going to run the real plays out the playbook. You're not going to get certain starters to play. That's coming back from injuries or that they're trying to be cautious with. DeAndre Le Levy, I told y'all you're not going to see him. What does he need to play in the preseason for? Look how long this man has been in the, in the NFL. He knows the defense in and out already. What rust? There's no rust. He's a linebacker. There's no rust in running and hitting people. As long as you have this and you're conditioned, which he is, you're fine. You don't need DeAndre Levy out there to fuck around and get hit and, and injured. Uh, not hit, injured. Over some bullshit. Over a preseason game that's that's really for the players that's trying to make the roster. So, with that being said, don't expect to see some of your starters play. And if they do play, don't expect to see too much of them. Don't sell yourself short on the preseason, bro. And the thing is, man, what you got to understand is the preseason. They are not going to run the pro sets. They are not going to uh, use the original playbook. They're experimenting with stuff during the preseason. They, they're running plays that they're saying, let's see how this play does. Maybe we can add this to the playbook. This is what you're getting in the, pre, in the preseason. So, yes, you see blown coverages. You see stuff like this and stuff like that. They're trying out stuff. Stop judging the preseason. Take this from an OG... <laughs> I mean, man, take this from an OG Lions fan, man, a Lions, a football watcher. I know better than that, man. I'm not going to sit here and make videos about the preseason. So, that's that. In other words, y'all got to chill out. <laughs> but, uh, with that being said, man, as far as Lions news, man, um, you know, of course, Amir Abdullah's back. Darius Slay is back, man. Catch is coming back just like, you know, the ones who know better 
we expected it to be that way. Because a lot of them really probably wasn't even really injured. They were just holding them out, giving them reason to hold them out. But uh, just being cautious with the players, which I think is smart on Caldwell's behalf. Because there's no reason to have your stars out there fucking around in pointless football games. Which ain't nothing to me but an extended practice is what it is. So, yes, the Lions got their ass beat the last preseason game. So fucking what? And? <laughs> and? What does that mean? That you supposed to be you supposed to be checking the temperature of of some of the talents of the players. Not looking at the scoreboard, because that doesn't matter in the preseason. No one gives a damn about the sport, I mean about the scoreboard, but fans that don't know what the hell they doing or what they looking at. Those is the only ones that give a fuck about the scoreboard. So <laughs> Them players out there are not giving a fuck about the scoreboard. Their whole thing is execution. All right? So even that the defense didn't execute in some people's eyesight, what you got to understand, you're not, you're not playing with a fully powered team either. You're not playing with a fully powered team. You're not in your regular defensive sets. All right? So that's one thing you got to understand. You ain't about to see... The Baltimore Ravens of the early 2000s in preseason. That's not what you're about to see, man. You're going to see them testing the waters so they can know, hey, we need to release this guy, just like Ridley, or we need to sign this somebody else, or we need to cut this guy. That's what the preseason is for. That's what your man wanted to talk to y'all about today. All right? I just wanted to give y'all the news or whatever, you know. Players is back. Ebron, of course, is back. So, you know, uh, Glaxlow is out the uh, boot and stuff. He's, he's back, just might as well say. So, like I said, man, that's what it's about. It's a measuring stick. It's a measuring stick to see what talent you got out there, these, these players that's trying to make the squad, man, and to test out plays. That's it. That's what the preseason is, and that's the understanding for... Uh, a lot of you angry Detroit fans. <laughs> so, at the end of the day, it's your boy King telling y'all chill the fuck out. <laughs> chill out, man. Just chill out. That's all I wanted to talk to y'all about, man. I'm about to go ahead on the hip periscope. I know a lot of my boys is up, man. It's about 11. Um, I'll catch up with y'all cats later, man.